if you can prepare for the GRE or the SAT, which is functionally also an IQ test, it seems to make sense that you could prepare for a different type of IQ test in the same way, where you just took a bunch of them and started to learn about how these sorts of patterns worked. Memory is an important component of intelligence. Let's think about your memory. Do, do you have a good memory and can you improve your memory? So if I shuffle a deck of cards and I hand it to you and I say, look at each card and memorize the order. So you have 52 cards randomly shuffled. You're going to memorize the order. And you will be able to go so far. And then I'll say, all right, I want you to go home and practice this for a month. And let's come back and we'll do it again. Is your memory going to be better? Probably. Mm. Now I'll say, okay, now I'm going to give you two decks shuffled together. And if you practice with two decks, how good can you get your memory to be? How about three decks or four decks? Is there going to be a limit to how much practice is going to improve your memory? And the answer is yes, there's going to be a limit. And if you come across a person that after the same amount of practice can remember two or three times further than you are, what do you conclude from that? That they were more motivated? That they grew up in a household where they practiced their memory more?